Although I love teaching technical accounting and audit topics, the CPA lifestyle, like I like to call it, is a lot more than just debits and credits. Being in professional services, a huge part of the business is your soft skills. And part of soft skills is personal hygiene, which we're gonna be getting into today. As I know a lot of young people like myself didn't get the best teaching in terms of what takes your career to the next level in the corporate world, today I'm gonna to show you guys the products that I use in my daily routine to show up the absolute best for myself, my clients, and everyone around me. Let's hop into the video. Personal hygiene, in my opinion, is really split up in five different categories. You have facial care, oral care, body care, hair care, and lastly, fragrances. I'm gonna go over every single category and within those categories, I'll cover every single product I use on a daily basis and there's gonna be timestamps in the bottom if you wanna go to a specific category for whatever you're looking for in this video. Let's start with facial care. Taking care of your face is probably one of the most important things you can do as a professional. That being said, there's really a few products that I use on my face and it's really not that many. The first thing you have to use is a basic face wash for your face. There's nothing else you should be applying on your beautiful face other than an actual face wash. I don't wanna see anyone using a bar of soap anymore or none of that. We are completely past that now. So get yourself a basic, basic face wash. I personally use the Bulldog one, even though I get the Tish Hanley products for my face as I'll kind of go over throughout this video. This face wash, in my opinion, is probably one of the best ones I've used. And I literally just pick it up at Target. I think it's like five or $6. This is definitely gonna take your skincare to the next level, which is we have the face wash, but you're not only gonna wash your face with just your hand, you know, just old school way. You're gonna use one of these bad boys. Look at this. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Love this thing. This thing is my baby. I use it again every single day, every time I wash my face in the shower. This isn't waterproof, so I would be very, very careful. I don't, you know, use it just like in the shower loosely. I kind of step away for a little bit and I just literally just kind of wash my face with it. I can totally feel the difference in my face. It just feels a lot better after I use this. Again, this thing, I bought this thing on Amazon for I think like $10, $15. I've had it for maybe two years now. Love it. Again, I use it every single day. Check that bad boy out. It's, it's, it's a great tool. Again, I use it every day and uh, it works great. As I mentioned earlier, I do use Tish Hanley. You can kind of look them up and every single product that I go over today is gonna to be linked below uh, in my through my Amazon site. So you'll be able to click and buy whatever products you wanna incorporate into your daily routine. But in my opinion, this the products from Tish Hanley too are really, really, really good. Uh, I always, I, I get a few comments on, on the videos that I post about my facial routine and how my skin is so clear. Uh, but these, the, the Tish Hanley products are great because and this is, I swear this is not a sponsored video from any one of these products. I'm not trying to sell you anything. I really use these every day. Uh, the T. Shanley products are by far the best bang for your buck. And it's very simple because you literally put in the system you want. You log into their site. You say, hey, I want to get the level one, level two, level three. I actually get the level three, which comes with an eye cream. So I get, I, I get an eye cream. I literally put one squirt under my eyes every day and it, it reduces a puffiness in your eyes, especially during busy season. You know, you we're working long hours. Uh, it's pretty tough. This thing does make a huge difference in my eyes. I put a little bit underneath my eyes every day before when I wake up and when I go to bed. I also use the serum. This serum, I, I am, I believe it or not, I am 31 years old now. <laughs> and uh, with that, uh, with being 31, also comes some wrinkles, unfortunately. Unfortunately, because, you know, as a man, sometimes it looks a little good, right? Obviously, girls will say maybe something different, but when it comes to facial care and reducing wrinkles and everything like that, preventative is always, always the best key. Once it's kind of there, it's always gonna be there. Unless you go do other things, which I'm not gonna talk about on this video because that's not what this video is about. Uh, I use a serum for my face. I love this stuff. I, again, I, I can totally tell now, especially using these products for probably two to three years, that it has made such a drastic difference in my overall appearance and my face. Uh, so the serum that I use, I, I get the level three system, which comes with an eye cream. And the serum, I absolutely love it. Again, I use it every morning and every night. Love this product. This scrub does come with the Tish Hanley level three system. I use this scrub twice a week. This isn't to be used every day. It's more of an exfoli exfoliating scrub. And again, I feel like every time I use this, I use this on Wednesday and Saturdays. This thing just makes my skin feel really good and brand new. So yeah, the scrub is awesome. Next thing up, I do use a AM moisturizer. I use this every single day. 
I do not go out without using my face wash and specifically my AM moisturizer. I, what I do love about this moisturizer is it has SPF 20, so it protects you against the sun. Especially me, uh, I don't. My family's like really prone to sunspots for whatever reason. Like my dad, he has a few, and I do not want that at all. And again, I think with skincare, the best care is preventative care. So the fact that the the the, the moisturizer that I use has SPF 20 is huge in my opinion. But if you let's say you use start using a moisturizer and you don't see that it has any uh, any sunscreen on it or any protective thing against the sun, I would start applying a little bit of sunscreen on your face, especially if you're going to be out a little bit grabbing lunch or whatever the case may be. I would definitely start using sunscreen again. I wish I would have started using these products when I was like 18 years old. It's, it's even unfortunate that I started a little bit later. That being said, using an AM moisturizer or a moisturizer in general after you use a face wash to keep your skin really moisturized and rejuvenated throughout the day, super, super it's a game changer. Next thing up, I use a bedtime uh, PM moisturizer. So this moisturizer, it's a little bit thicker. It doesn't have SPF, it doesn't have sunscreen on it, uh, but it, it does feel very, very good, especially before I go to bed. I don't know what it is, but it just makes me feel rejuvenated. It literally makes me feel like I'm getting ready for bed and like I'm like going on a date with my bed. <laughs> It's the weirdest thing ever. It just feels great. Um, I just feel rejuvenated. I feel good about myself. Uh, my face feels really clean, especially because I apply first the face wash, then the uh, the eye cream, then the serum, and then the, I use the PM moisturizer again. It's only used at night, and I absolutely love it. Last thing I use for my face is a clay mask. Today is actually Sunday, and I use this clay mask every single Sunday night. What happens with this clay mask, and I do feel it, is that it kind of just removes all the dead skin from your face, and it kind of give, gives you that new layer of skin. And again, I'm not a dermatologist, I'm a CPA, I don't really know the technical term, but I can definitely feel that that it does help my skin a lot. It kind of just gives away, go, go, uh, goes away with all the gunk on my face that I've kind of accumulated through the week. And I just feel like I have a brand new face for Monday. And again, I love it. It's a clay mask. I do get it also from T. Shanley, but you can find them anywhere on Target. Again, this is a little bit more, I, I don't want to say it's more advanced when it comes to skincare, but that that's really, um, I, I think the clay mask is really optional. Uh, I don't think it's, you know, that necessary per se, but start using it. Maybe start applying one. See if you feel a difference. If you just like doing it. I love this clay mask. Again, I use it every Sunday, just once a week. Do not use clay mask more than once a week because it is kind of damaging to the skin, obviously, because it removes all the dead skin. So just make sure you use a clay mask. If you do once a week is more than enough. Now let's get into oral care. One of the best investments I ever made for my oral care and my mouth was getting one of these electric oral B toothbrushes. This thing is probably one of the best things I have ever purchased in my life. I absolutely love it. It's my baby. I use it. I sometimes use it three times a day when I when I'm working from home. I do brush my teeth after lunch. But getting one of these electric toothbrushes is a game changer. I can't believe I had been washing my teeth literally for 28 years, just kind of manually. These things are, are super powerful, and I'd be lying to you if I didn't if I tell you I didn't do this too. I wasn't guilty of it. But you know, when you brush your teeth manually, you don't really have a timer telling you, hey, you should brush your teeth for two minutes. Sometimes this is kind of gross, but it, especially when I was younger, I would kind of just brush my teeth, you know, manually and for maybe, I don't know, 30 seconds, a minute at most. And I'd be like, okay, that sounds good. No, with this Oral-B toothbrush, you turn it on and it literally, it will give you four beeps as soon as you've brushed your teeth for two minutes. So I don't have to have a timer or anything. I just automatically know, hey, I turn it on and it'll literally give me one beep for 30 seconds and then a minute, a minute 30. And then at two minutes, it'll give me four pulses, which tells me I'm pretty much done brushing my teeth. Again, you can get this at Costco. These things are freaking amazing. I love my Oral-B toothbrush. Again, you just got to replace the heads every, I don't know, I, I replace mine once a month and you get a pack at Costco for, for I get the 12 pack at Costco for once a year. This thing is awesome. Again, Oral, you have to, have to get a, an electric toothbrush. It's probably one of the best investments I have ever made. Second thing up for oral care is gonna get yourself a high quality toothpaste. I love this one personally. Again, I love Costco, so I get all pretty much a lot of my stuff either at Amazon or Costco. This toothpaste, in my opinion, is probably one of the best ones I've ever used. I can definitely see the difference if I stop using this toothpaste. I kind of see the difference in my teeth that they get a little bit more stained. Stop, you know, going with the, the I don't know, liquor store toothpaste. I really like this one. Again, um, you can kind of try different ones and see what, what works and what doesn't work or what your teeth respond good to. I really don't have sensitive teeth, so a lot of people say they may have sensitive teeth to get Sensodyne. Whatever the case may be, just invest in a high quality toothpaste. Next thing up is gonna be mouthwash. I love my, I love this Crest 3D white mouthwash. I think having pearly whites is 
is is such a game changer and you know, I I try to you know like my team. I try to have the best. I try to smile at probably everyone I approach, everyone I come to, especially when you're meeting, networking people. The first thing people look at is your teeth. And fortunately or unfortunately, when when I was younger, I was very fortunate that my parents actually you know got me braces when I was a kid. Uh, if I if my parents hadn't got me braces, I probably would have got them already, even as a professional. I think having a very healthy smile, having white teeth, having straight teeth, you know, for for whatever it is, good or bad, it's it's super critical and super important to your career because again, that's the first thing people look at. And having a nice smile, having some, something that's very welcoming and and warming and, and refreshing is is something that's very beautiful. And you you know, you see it in people, I see it in people, and it's something that I thrive for to, and I strive for every single day. Uh, that being said, I think this Crest 3D White. Uh, mouthwash again I use it I kind of go off and on with it I use it one month and then I leave it for one month just because again it is kind of it, it is uh, not damaging to your teeth but it can be very sensitive even I feel it on my teeth at times after I use it for more than a month straight so again I use it for one month on one month off and again I love it I, I think it does make a huge difference in keeping my teeth um, nice and white one thing I use every single day, uh, literally every single day, I don't stop using it, is this Thorough Breath mouthwash. This thing for fresh breath, I don't know what it is, I don't know what it does, but this thing is amazing. I just came across this actually like two months ago and I absolutely love it. I use it every single day, morning and night. This is something that I, even if you have sensitive teeth, I, I don't think it. I don't think it's gonna harm you at all. Again, I love mine, I absolutely love it. Fresh Breath Oral Rinse. This thing is a game changer when it comes to having good breath. I don't know what it is, but man, this thing is awesome. I love it and I uh, highly recommend you incorporate this into your daily routine. One other thing I use is the tongue scraper. I got this again off of Amazon. I absolutely love it. It does with the first the first time I started using it, I can tell that there was, you know, a bunch of gunk on my on my on my tongue. This tongue scraper is awesome. Again, I use it pretty much after I brush my teeth. I go through the tongue scraper. Absolutely love this product. I think I think I got about two of them off of Amazon for like 10 bucks. Amazing product. I love it. I put it in this little this little container and I keep it in my sh in my bathroom just like that. One of the biggest things too, especially when you meet people and you're in professional services, whether you know you're meeting a potential client or you're meeting a nice young lady or whatever the case may be, you're meeting a date. Having nice lips that are you know nice, moist, and the first thing people pay attention to when you meet them is your mouth area, your teeth. You want to make sure they're nice and white, like we just went over. And also, I've tried so many lip balms. I've tried the burst and the bees. I've tried everything. This Vaseline lip therapy, I promise you, man, you literally put a little bit on your, put a little bit on your pinky. Just a, apply a little bit. Oh man, look at that. Wow. I love it. I love it. I absolutely, this thing keeps your lips nice and moist all day and maybe through the midday or, you know, once it starts getting later, just again, put a little bit on your, on, on your pinky, rub it in. And I promise you, you maybe apply this once or twice a day. It leaves you feeling refreshed all day. Last up for oral care is going to be these white strips. I get these white strips. I probably use white strips every other month. Again, I don't try to use too many products that are going to be, that make my teeth really, really sensitive or going to be harmful. I kind of try to go off and on, but mount, but white strips are something that I use kind of one month on, one month off, one month on, one month off. And just before actually filming this video, uh, if you guys tell, I actually put one of these on because what I do to kind of make sure that I incorporate, that I shower and get everything ready as quick as I can is that what, before I shower, I literally put my white strips on and while I'm getting ready, while I'm in the shower, while I come out, I start doing everything else I need to do, it literally takes me about half an hour to get ready. And by the time I'm done getting ready, just kind of take them off, uh, rinse my mouth a little bit and I'm all done. And that's pretty much what I use for my oral care. Again, you can kind of go off and on with these products, but highly recommend bar none getting yourself a electric toothbrush and also investing in a high quality toothpaste that you're gonna use every single day. And hopefully you can incorporate the other items such as the mouthwash for your teeth, uh, the mouthwash for your breath and, and just overall good hygiene. Uh, the white strips are great and also the tongue scraper. Now let's go over body care. Body care is super important and the products I'm gonna go over because this is what's gonna really elevate how you smell during the day. First one up, super basic. I've used probably every deodorant product under the sun. 
And believe it or not, this degree, this degree black and white it prevents anti-yellow and white stains. I like it. It's super simple. It's really cheap. You can just pick it up at Target. It's like two, it's like three to four dollars. I like it. It doesn't stain my clothes. It doesn't give me all these yellow marks and it, it smells relatively neutral. So I really, really like it. Every day during the shower, I think the best thing you can use is a body wash, uh, one that smells good. My favorite one, and again, I've tried so many, uh, this bourbon by uh, Bath and Body Works, this bourbon body wash, I love it. It's, oh, it's It smells so good. And I literally, it just, I, I look forward to showering every single day because of it. This bourbon body wash, can't tell you how many compliments I, I've received. Even in my shower, it makes it just smell better overall. Bourbon body wash, pick it up at Bath and Body Works or any scented one. And one thing I do want to point out, although it does say three in one hair, face, and body, please, 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 like I mentioned today, do not be using body wash on your face or your hair. It's going to dry it out. It's going to damage it. It's going to be no good. For your hair, like I mentioned earlier, you want to make sure you use only hair only product, either wash or or low or, or conditioner. Either or, don't use a mixture of both on, on a daily basis. But when it comes to body wash, get yourself one that's that's a body wash that you're only going to use for your body. Although this one's a three in one, I like the smell. It's, it smells really good. It lathers really well. It lasts me a long time and it's relatively cheap. Now, while you're in the shower, a lot of people use a loofah. I personally love these kind of shower rags. Again, I got them off. The, they'll be linked below on Amazon. One side is more for exfoliating and kind of really scrubbing things out. And one soft side is more for washing. I just buy, I think I have three or four of these. I literally use them every week when I shower, I throw them in the washer after, and then I come out, dry them and I I use them again. Again, they're reusable, so I absolutely love these. And especially, you know, you need to really scrub out all the dirt out of you. I know a lot of people, is, and I'm telling you because I went through it myself when I was younger. I kind of just would like shower for, I felt like I, I rinsed more than I actually showered. When you shower, please shower. Like actually wash yourself. Use the body wash we just went over. Put it on this rag and literally like scrub your body out, you know, as much as you can uh, with this. And this will literally make you feel brand new. Every time I use this, every time I shower every day, uh, I just feel like a brand new person after I come out. I use this every time I shower and then pretty much when I'm done, I just put it in the hamper and at the end of the week, I wash them and I reuse them every week. Absolutely love them. Next one up for the body and this one's going to be definitely a little funny to, to bring up. It's uh, this chassis product that I... I just started using this actually in 2023 and I can tell you that it's an absolute game changer. I can't believe I hadn't used uh, kind of man powder before. Obviously this goes in your, you know, in your man parts and um, after you shower, once you're all dry, you put this on and it just keeps you really dry and it just gives you a, like a really chilly sensation when you put it on. It actually feels really good and it just, it just keeps you smelling good, um, you know, down there all day and, and I love it. I absolutely love it, especially when you know you, when you wear your suits that are fitted and you're pretty much working all day, especially during busy season. This product I absolutely love. I've had it for pretty much, I think two to three months already. I use it every single day and there's still, I mean, I, this is probably gonna last me. I think this one will probably last me six months and it wasn't even that expensive. Again, chassis, this man care, absolutely love it. I didn't start using it till this year and I can't believe I went so long without it. Part of that and part of, you know, taking care of, of, of your, the man parts down there is this Manscaped, um, it's a ball deodorant. Yes, it's a ball deodorant. I know it sounds a little funny to say, but um, yeah, it's a ball deodorant, anti-chafing. Again, you just put a little bit on your on your hands and then you put it, you know, where where you're supposed to. And and again, I, I can't believe I went 30 years of my life without using this chassis man powder and also this this ball deodorant. I absolutely love both. I, again, it just it makes me smell and feel good, you know, down there. And especially when I'm working late hours, when I pretty much leave my house at 7, 8 a.m. and I don't come home till 9 p.m. I just feel like it really keeps me fresh in, in those areas all day. And, and it just prevents any, you know, dampness or swampness or any of that stuff that, that usually does happen. And I'm telling you, game changer. I can't believe I went so long without using it. And then also to right when you get out of the shower, one thing that I've, I've been doing now for only the recent like last year or two, especially as I got more evolved in fragrances and, and applying colognes, this Vaseline Cocoa Radiant Lotion is by far, if there's one thing you buy from this video, please let it be this. I picked this up at Target and I absolutely love it. So after you shower, what you need to do, since your pores are all open, you're literally going to do a few squirts of this. You're going to put it in your neck on your body, on your arms, on your legs. And this thing will just keep you smelling so good all day and your your skin is really rejuvenated. Again, do not put this on your face 
Only facial products go on your face, okay? Don't put it on your face. But overall, using this body lotion, and when I go into the fragrances, you'll understand why too I use this. But this thing keeps me super moisturized throughout the day. You don't want to be all ashy and, and gross. Uh, that's pretty nasty. So you just want to make sure you use this. I Again, I've used a lot of lotions. This is by far my favorite. And it has more of like that cocoa butter smell that it's not all scenty. And I absolutely love it. Part of that too is using Vaseline. This Vaseline is amazing. I love this product. This petroleum jelly Vaseline, where I usually put this at is just behind my ears and on my chest. It's really the only, the only place I'm gonna apply cologne is gonna be where I apply this. This thing will have your cologne smelling good all day. And what ends up happening, because you put the lotion on first, right? It really soaks into your skin and it kind of adds a layer on top of your skin. And especially when you apply your cologne in the places of all, or I'll teach you later in this video, where to apply cologne and how many to apply. It'll make, it'll make your cologne last all freaking day. I promise you it's probably the, one of the best things I've done is again, just apply it behind the ears or wherever you're going to apply cologne. I put this Vaseline right on my wrists behind my ears and right here on my neck where the where I where I put my cologne at is where this goes. Okay, when it comes to your body and taking care of it also, this manscape tool is obviously to take care of, you know, your manly needs and I absolutely love this one. I've had it for three years now, especially, I don't, you know, me, I, I like kind of trimming, you know, the, 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 the hair on, on my body in different, different areas because it just keeps it more dry throughout the day, especially when you have a lot of hair on you. Um, especially me, I tend to be a little bit more hairy. Um, it kind of, it kind of creates a little bit of a damp smell at times and can it make you more sweaty? So picking up one of these Manscaped tools and you know trying it out for yourself and taking care of yourself, probably one of the best things I ever did, but this Manscaped tool is probably one of my favorites. It actually doesn't have a clip right now because I literally, I get new clips uh, every month. I get new, new razors that go on top of it and they're replaceable. And again, I bought this two, three years ago, absolutely love it. And all you have to do is replace the, the, the blades on top. For my body and kind of my face in general, um, my Brio is my go-to tool for my beard. It's the one thing that keeps me clean. I don't, that's one thing I don't really pay for to keep my beard um, nice and check and I do it myself. Check this thing out. This thing is awesome. It's probably one of my favorite things and my favorite tools in my arsenal. Absolutely love it. I recharge it. I've had this for two to three years. A little bit on the pricey side when you initially buy it, but having a Brio Beardscape, it just makes sure that you keep your beard clean, especially for those of you that have a beard. I think having a beard is a blessing. I think it's something that really adds to uh, my personality and who I am and kind of people associate having a beard with, with, with me and you know they know me as having a beard and I, I love that and I think it definitely adds a lot of a lot of swag and, and to who I am. That being said, if you have a beard, please maintain it. There's nothing worse than having a beard and it being all over the place. And then, you know, it's all dirty down here and it looks like you haven't shaved in, you know, three weeks. And it just does not look good when you do that. So please make sure that if you're going to have a beard, I think uh, having one of these and don't use the same tool that you use for your body and other parts, um, other private parts for your face. Please don't do that. That's, that's disgusting. Don't, that's gross, man. Don't do that. So you want to make sure anything that you use on your face, you don't use in other areas. That's why I have the Manscaped for my body and, and other areas and also the Brio Beardscape for the only part which I use for my face. This next one's gonna be a little funny too and I went very, uh, I went almost my whole life without using these and I can't believe I did because now I use them and I really can't do a certain thing now without them. So these are called dude wipes. These, and these are to-go wipes. I take these dude wipes, this little pack, I buy it from Amazon. I buy, uh, I get a pack of, I think it comes with like 30 wipes to go. I take these, I have a few of these in my work bag every single day and as you would know, when you you know do your thing, uh, you you use a restroom and you do what you need to do. Um, this is to clean yourself after, and this is probably, in my opinion, it literally makes you feel like you took a shower after. And once you use them, I promise you, you will never go back to not using it. I promise you, once you start using these dude wipes, again, these are pretty much keep these at my house every day uh, when I have to do what I gotta do. And then these, when I take these in my work bag in case you know duty calls and I need to do what I need to do at, at the office or whatever, or I'm at a client site, uh, if I use these, I promise you, you just feel cleaner in, in general. And I can't believe I went so long without using these dude wipes, because again, Absolutely love them, highly recommend them. These are kind of the more to-go packs. I love them because I literally just sometimes put it in my suit jacket, I'm gonna go, and then they have obviously the bigger packs that would go in your home. 
absolutely going to change your life and elevate it. You're just going to feel overall cleaner about yourself. And when you don't use them, you're definitely going to feel like, oh my gosh, I can't believe people actually don't use them. So I promise you, start incorporating these into your daily routine. Absolute game changers. Taking care of your hair is also super important. I am very, very fortunate to have a full set of hair at my age. I am. I don't take that for granted at all. That being said, I do my best to try to take care of it. And with that, I do tend to blow dry my hair. I actually have really curly hair naturally. So I use this hair, uh, hair protector spray every time before I blow dry my hair. It just kind of protects it from the heat that you expose yourself to all the time. So I actually been using this for, for a very, very, I think I've been using this for probably seven years now before I blow dry my hair. Cause again, I do have natural, natural curly hair. So with that, I do protect it with this Tresemme kind of heat tamer. It helps it out. Again, I just sprayed one or two sprays before I kind of work it in before I actually blow dry my hair. Cause again, I do have to blow dry it uh, almost every day before I go to work. So it does protect me from the heat. I didn't really bring my, what I actually use for my hair when it comes to washing it and, and making sure that it's moisturized every day. So what I do is uh, every other day I tend to wash it or every third day, you, I recommend that you don't wash your hair every day because it does damage it, especially if you wash it with, I don't know, head and shoulders, which is what I typically use uh, to wash my hair. I don't recommend that you wash your hair every day. It can be very damaging, but you can condition it almost every day. And with that, I do condition my hair with this argon oil, uh, leave-in conditioning repair cream. I pretty much use this, I think, every third day or at least every Saturday and Sunday when I'm at home. Pretty much every day that I'm not doing my hair, this Cantu Argon Oil is super, super good. I, every time I put it on my hair, the next day, I feel like I have like the best hair days just because it really conditions my hair. And then to actually style my hair, I've gone through as many products as you can think of. I probably used every single product that's at Target or anything that you can think of off the shelf. And this is by far Pacino's, the matte product is my favorite because I, I don't have too much hair. That being said, I do want it to stay kind of in place and have a matte finish. I hate when my hair looks really shiny. So this Pacino's matte product is probably one of my favorites that I've used. You can buy it at Target. It's $19. It pretty much lasts me two months and I don't really use that much. And you know, you guys can see kind of my hair is pretty much matte, stays in place all day. Absolutely love it. Last item up is actually gonna be fragrances. These two fragrances are probably my favorite. And I know sometimes maybe you're watching this and you're in college or you're a little younger. I, I would highly recommend that you save up your money and you invest in a high quality fragrance because these two that I'm gonna give you today are absolute game changers in my opinion. The fragrance that literally got me introduced to taking care of myself and actually taking accountability for how I smelled every day, the King Sauvage. This is probably, I bought this bottle three years ago when again, I kind of started to get into personal development and taking care of myself. Look, it's literally almost done and I've had this bottle for three or four years now. Again, I absolutely love this fit. I think it's such a beginner scent and such a such a daily scent that you can use every single day. I know a lot of dudes use this and uh, rightfully so. Absolutely love it. I probably use it three days out of the week and uh, again, absolutely love it. It's a really fresh scent. I think it goes well. It's like an all year round. You can use it in the winter time, in the summertime. It's very fresh. A great starter scent, um, a little bit more on the price side if you're a little bit worried about budget, but again, I think it's worth the investment. Second scent up, and I'm gonna give my boy over at Teaching Men's Fashion a shout out uh, because he creates some high quality products. And I, since I'm big on I, I'm big on scents and I'm only showing you kind of three that are in my collection right now that, I, or that are my absolute favorite, this Asavache scent he came up with is in my opinion, probably one of the best ones I've, I've ever tried. It just, it's very musky. It just, it gives you that sense of just being a man. I, I, I can't explain it. It just, you know what? Let, let's, let's do a, a live scent right now. Let's put this on. Oh my gosh. Look at that bottle too. You have that bottle in your room, right in your nightstand. I'm telling you, you have, you know, friends come over, whoever you have coming over. I'm telling you, it's going to be a game changer in your life. Jose Zuniga, you outdid yourself, my friend. This thing is good. This thing is legit. Who knows? I might even come out with my own scent one day. And last, but, and then I wanted to highlight this scent too, because, um, it's one of my favorites and it's probably something I use only on special occasions, maybe a graduation, a wedding, a really important dinner. Centaur 33. This thing is, this bottle within itself, this is, in my opinion, it's super pricey, uh, but I think it's it's worth it, uh, especially because I probably, this will probably last me another few years because I only use it maybe, I don't know, once a month, if that. Um, this Centaur 33 is, 
it's just it's just it's just a manly overall just a, an expensive scent that smells just classy overall all right let's stack them let, let's stack our scents today so let, let's do let's do one on this side let's try that out yeah that's a game changer man again special occasions like this video weddings uh, super super important dates whatever you have going on this one, I would not recommend you you buy this until you're maybe a little bit more experienced and you have a nice collection already because, again, this bottle is $400 and it's literally this small. So, again, I, do, I don't recommend you buying this one straight as your first one. But, uh, you know, once you're a little bit more senior, once you have a little bit years of experience, definitely something to keep in your arsenal for super special occasions. As far as when you're in the office and things happen, I know, you know, before you go into meetings or after you have lunch, maybe you had a lunch that, you know, you're eating a certain thing that um, – you know, it doesn't smell as good. One thing that I always do after lunch is I use these Listerine sprays. Literally, all you do is, oh my gosh. I don't know what it does, man. This thing just smells amazing. It gives your breath such a fresh scent. And I usually do um, two to three sprays throughout the day, especially after I eat or after my morning coffee. I usually just rinse my mouth out. I guess I'll spray another one of these. Oh. Whew. Yeah, this thing is, is super powerful. I love it. Listerine sprays, again, got it on Amazon. Super great, especially, let's say you've been at the office all day and you have a networking event after or you have um, you, ha you have to meet someone after lunch. This thing is super important, especially rinse your mouth out and then put this on. Promise you, game changer. As last thing up for overall fragrances, it's not really a fragrance, but in my opinion, I, I think it just helps with your overall, how your breath smells during the day is this phallum gum. I, I have, I'm like almost through it already. But this phallum gum, a lot of like um, YouTube influencers will promote it because apparently it gives you like a better jawline overall because you just chew it all day. But this phallum gum, it's great because it has no flavor. It, it doesn't have anything in it. It has no sugar, no anything. But I use it just to chew all day because what happens, the more your mouth is dry and not moist and not and not lubricated, the more it'll kind of, it'll gather up a lot of bacteria and a lot of bad smells. So the more you can kind of keep hydrated and, and obviously gum, chewing gum throughout the day will keep your mouth moist. Super, super helpful. And not only that, also smelling good is going to be keeping hydrated. I think drinking water uh, throughout the day is, is going to keep your, it, it just keeps your overall system in check it keeps you overall healthy but i i can't you know scientifically say this uh, because i'm not again i'm a cpa but i can i can attest to the fact that i drink a lot of water and somehow some way that just adds to the sense and i'm i'm literally smelling the asavache and the centile 33 and again i just love it overall i just feel great and all these products that i went over today i literally used them right before i made this video and i just feel and and, and look i hope my absolute best one thing that I need to go over is actually how to apply the cologne that you choose to buy. Whichever one you want to go with, this is how you're supposed to do it. This is how I've done it. I've done so many mistakes like rubbing my wrists together. This is literally what I do every single day. Maybe some people might seem like it's a lot. And it depends where you're going. If I'm going to the office, for example, the only sprays I do is I do one on, the, one, one, on one side of my neck, one on the other side of my neck, one on my chest, and just one on the wrist. That, that's kind of, I, I limit it to pretty much four, three to four, depending. Uh, if I'm going to be in a super close space with, um, let's say I'm going to be in an audit room all day, I typically will only go with three sprays just because, again, you don't want to be too overpowering, especially if you're in the office. But if I'm going to a networking event, if I'm going to a dinner or some night out, whatever it is, if it's going to be kind of in a more open space, I'm going to go with five sprays. I know some people might say that's a lot. Personally, in my opinion, I don't think it is. I like getting, I like showing up somewhere and people knowing that, damn, that guy smells good. So one thing I'll do again, right behind the ear, right behind the other side of the ear where we applied the Vaseline from earlier, right on top of the chest, like right here, one on one wrist and one on the other wrist. Five sprays, max is all you need. I promise you with a good scent, you're going to be turning heads all day, especially with either the Asavache, the Sauvage, or the Centaur 33. These, these fragrances, in my opinion, game changers and highly, highly recommend. Again, the Centaur 33, I would wait on this one, but the Asavache or the Sauvage, 
fully, highly, highly recommend you put them in your arsenal of fragrances. Although all the products I went over today may seem like a lot, I promise you if you start incorporating one by one into your daily routine over the next month, over the next six months, over the next two years, I promise you, you're gonna elevate your style, your personal hygiene, and your overall professional presence to the next level. That's gonna be it for the video today. If you found value in the video, please make sure to smash the like button below. Until next time, work hard, dress well, peace.